Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Another change of scenery. We're no longer in Mexico, but I'm back in Finland and it is sunny. I'm loving it. Spring has really hit home here in Finland and it's been like 15 degrees every day and sunny and I've been loving it. It may be not the best conditions to film in, but I love the weather. Anyways, a few weeks back, I filmed a video called My Favorite Lens with my friend Rope. And in that video, I filmed all the B-roll clips at 720 HD, 120 frames per second. Yeah, that's right, 720 HD. And when I was first making that video, I actually didn't even know that the Canon EOS R can do 120 frames per second. And when I saw it, I was like, oh sweet, 120 frames per second, that's super smooth, nice B-roll. But then I saw that it's 720 HD and I was like, ah, uh, nah. I can't do it, it's not good enough quality. But then I started thinking about it, I was like, what the heck, let's just try it for one video. And it was interesting when I started editing the video, I was like, this footage looks really epic, it's really nice looking. But when I uploaded the video, I was so nervous as to how you guys would react. I was just waiting in suspense thinking, will people notice or not that I filmed it in 720 HD? In the end, there was only one comment. One comment out of 44 comments out of 2,700 views. 720, really? And it was so interesting for me because I was thinking that everyone was gonna comment on that video saying, what, 720 HD, why would you use that? And it really got me thinking, is 720 really dead or not? It made me realize that sometimes we're so focused on having the most high quality footage that we limit our options. We think, I can't film with that camera or with that resolution because it's just not high quality enough. But the question I wanna throw out to you guys is, is that do you really need 4K all the time? Or is it the wise option always? The longer I've been a filmmaker, I've realized that not one camera or resolution or frame rate suits all. For example, I'm not gonna shoot a wedding 120 frames per second all day long. That would be a very slow paced film. But when I make a trial film, I might film all the epic B-roll shots in 120 frames per second. I wouldn't film 720 HD for a feature film or a high quality commercial, but I don't mind it for a YouTube video. I think it's perfectly okay. I film 4K for some projects, other projects I'm doing 1080 or 720. It depends what suits best and what's gonna serve my own purposes in the end. So in my opinion, 720 HD isn't dead. It's all about realizing what the project is and what's gonna serve you best. Which camera, which frame rate, which resolution is gonna get you the best product in the end and the best workflow. Also, I wanna encourage a lot of you guys who are just starting out in the filmmaking process. It's so easy to look up at these different YouTube filmmakers or feature filmmakers and see the gear that they're using and you're thinking, man, I just can't create what they're creating because of the camera that you have. But I wanna say to you guys, it doesn't matter in the end what resolution it is because if you're creative with your camera, if you understand light, you can get really amazing, epic looking footage even at 720 HD. So don't ever limit yourself if your camera can't do 4K, if you can't get 120 frames per second, just try to use what you have in your camera and use it to the best of your abilities. So guys, I hope you were encouraged by this video as well. I hope they didn't rock the boat too much. And as well, guess what? All the B-roll film in this video, 720 HD.